If you've recently purchased a receiver that has SBUS output capability, such as this Orange R800 model, and you want to tie it to the KK2 board using firmware that supports the SBUS, that signal from the receiver will need to be inverted before the KK2 receiver can accept it. In order to accomplish that, I used a 7404 IC, which you can purchase from Radio Shack or any other electronic supply house. This has six inverters present. I'm only using the one. I'm using the one between pins 13 and 12, but you could actually use any of the other inverters if you like. You have to connect the input signal line to pin 13 and the output signal line on the other side of your connector to pin 12. The plus V gets tied to pin 14 and ground gets tied to pin 7. Also the other inputs on 1, 3, 5, 9, and 11 are also tied to ground to simply minimize power dissipation within this particular IC. <clears throat> This is the IC itself. I've turned it over. It's in a standard 14-pin dip package. This pin is VCC, and that's 14. 13 is my input pin. 12 is my output pin. And all the other input pins and ground are all tied together on a simple wire bus that I've made and tie grounds for both sides of the connectors up to that bus. Apply a heat shield or a shrink sleeve that I've labeled so that I can keep a track of which side is the input and which side is the output. So the input will go to the receiver and the output will go to the KK2 board. Hope this is helpful.